looked upon as being probably the greatest composer who ever lived. He was able to take the techniques of composers before him and bring them to the highest level. Composers who followed Bach were greatly influenced by his compositional techniques. Bach is the master teacher of music history. You find traces of his thinking, of his creative thinking in the works of other composers. The work is very broad, very large. We have so many different types of music. Bach brings together many ways of his work. Bach, of course, was the great improviser in music. And there's an extraordinary freedom that emerges from his scores. But also there's this wonderful structure which is a great lesson to any composer in terms of pace and movement and scale. I think it is a music which can combine two things which otherwise are very difficult to combine. He has a wonderful order in his music and everyone who listens to that music can understand this without being a musicologist. And on the other side he has a wonderful freedom, his fantasy, his uh, gift of improvising goes through that order. And we all know very well how difficult is that to have law and order and structure and on the other side give leeway to freedom, to liberty. And Bach combines both. There is something in the work of Bach which one can learn. These are structures, these are harmonies, these are connections between text and the sound, which make you open your eyes and listen to it and feel enriched. 